fix it to where you can see the messages over there. Can you shape change it? <laughs> Look at him. Spectators and spectator comments. About five minutes till we start up. Slam. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What up? What up? Yep. Gamer emergency. All fucking gamers on deck. <laughs> I thought I should have named the damn headline. We're gonna get into it. We're trying to get some more heads in here. What's going down? What's going down? What up? Uh, Cheers. I know I should probably get a drink too. I put a little Gatorade. They put Gatorade in there? That's what we're in right now, fam. The playroom. No, that was him sending you a message. Mm, yeah, I don't know what to tell him. Might want to sign into my PlayStation on my phone then, because uh, if he ain't in here, he ain't in here. I can't send him a message. I'm going to stop the whole damn thing. No, it's fine. Yeah. Oh, where's your phone? So you can just text him, can't you? Yeah, right there on the thing. No, Lucas. Really is. Can't turn that music off or what? Do I have to have uh do I have to have what you call it connected? Uh what the fuck is it called, bro? Hey, no dude, what are you doing, man? Back up. No. No, no, no. You gotta back up, yeah? You can't get that. You sit here. Play with that. Shit, uh, remote play. Because uh, I turned remote play off my console. No, I don't think that's it. No, no. Lucas. April, grab your son, dude. No, that's not it. It's like it has to be on that other. Well, I don't understand why it's saying like. Oh, that was Rillo, um, huh? Andrew, yeah. They sent that bit, that message. Yeah. And also, Andrew's like signed in. When I connected it, I connected it to yours, not Andrew's, right? Why would it be well, Andrew's? It settings. It wasn't under.
Harry needs a haircut. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Not you. Yeah, man. We're getting some traffic, though, dude. Yeah. That's quick, dude. Yeah. We just gotta have some shit popping. Yeah. What do you wanna do, like, until we can get. <laughs> this kid, dude. Hey. Sucker fish. <laughs> What you got? What you got? Go get it. <laughs> Give it to me. Yeah. Oh yeah, I got it. Gamer emergency, all gamers on deck, bruh. I'm telling you, PS5, man, Xbox X. We gotta work together and get what we want. So did you look at the games? Did you look at the games that are coming out on this? That they had on the launch, or not the launch. What was it called the other day, the little thing that they did? Yeah, that was the, the console announcement. Console announcement. You know what I'm kind of disappointed in? Without E3, like, the announcements are whack. They're not even, like, they're, like, baby giving you information. It's like they don't want to give tell you everything because Xbox hasn't released theirs. You know what I mean? <laughs> Have we, I don't even know if we've seen what the Xbox looks like currently right now. Oh, yeah, yeah we do. Just that big, like, cube? Is that oh, really no, what yeah, it looks like? Oh, no, yeah, that's it. That's it, but we haven't seen, we haven't seen the other one. I don't know if they're going to have an all digital they are or, gonna have or, an all digital. or what, but yeah, yeah. Which is whack. Are they going to have 4K? It's got to have 4K, <coughs> right? Uh, yeah. I don't know what I'm saying. <coughs> Definitely going to have some 4K. All digital sucks, kind of, because then you're not going to have your 4K player. You're going to have to buy the digital version of the movie, I guess, which is going to take up more room. Some people don't buy movies. That's true. <laughs> Everything is <coughs> and a lot of stuff on the PlayStation Network, at least, is rented. So you can rent games and you're just streaming it. Yeah. You don't even need to download it. Do we know how much how much space does the PS5 come with? I think it's like 825 meg gigs or something. Oh, not even a full terabyte? Not even a full terabyte. That's crazy. What about the all, that's all, what about the all digital version? <coughs> Is that the lowest, the all digital is going to be cheaper than shit. I know. I don't know about but is it going to have more room because it's all digital? Because digital takes up more room than disc, no? No, not present day. That used to be a thing. Yeah. But now, you got to download. Hey, 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 hey. Dude. <laughs> hey. Oh my god. Dang, bro. You're looking at him damn headbutt you, dude. Dude, no. He did headbutt me in the middle of the night the other night. So I'm sleeping. <coughs> did not sleep, dude. Boom, he busted me in the face. So I'm thinking, now I'm going to have to deal with a crying baby, right? And a busted, like, lip. But no, he did not even wake up. He just slept through the whole damn thing, and I'm crying with my lip busted. He didn't give a damn. Yeah, he that's, be his face. that's because he's used to, like, he's like, oh, I bust my head all night on my damn crib. <laughs> Not a big deal. <laughs> I mean, we should get him some bumpers to go around. Yeah, dude. no doubt. Well, because it's not safe when they're little to have that, but I guess it's fine now. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna uh, yeah, get he it. thinks he's gonna get something, that's for sure. <laughs> We're just giving us control. Yeah, right? man, so what are you thinking, dude? You you, you watched. So, I, mean, you know, I got my thoughts, but I want to hear what you're talking about, what you're thinking about it. So I thought all the games were whack. You thought all the games were whack. <laughs> okay, I thought I mean, that there was no game worth willing real. to buy the PlayStation 5 at launch. There's no game what that... What about the Xbox Series X? I want to buy Halo. I want to play Halo, so yeah, wow. I think that I would buy it at launch. Well, 
I mean, I don't know. I don't know. And yeah. I also think that the big announcement, like their starter announcement. There's things I'm looking like I really wanted them to drop though on that as a launch title. I don't yeah, know, man. Yeah, of course. But. Okay, let's see. You gotta stop being a hater right off the bro. You lost half our fucking fans, bro, on some <laughs> hater shit. <laughs> the fact that they started with Grand Theft Auto. There's not a damn thing I want. I don't even want anything. <laughs> don't buy the console. It's a piece of shit. The fact that they wanted to start, they started off with Grand Theft Auto was like their big announcement. It was kind of disappointing. Bruh. That was whack, too. Because everybody in their, their, their brat has been talking about... Get that, dude. He's got a sharpener in his fucking hand, man. Yeah. Um, we're talking about how there might be a new GTA dropping and shit. GTA, oh, really? GTA 6, GTA 6, GTA 6. Yeah, man. And then they announced and then, GTA 5. And then they show GTA 5 on the, on the what you call it, man. It's going to be free. You get a million coins. Yeah. <laughs> No, but you know what does look dope, dude? Spider-Man. The, the... Miles little, Morales. The, yeah. But were you the one that was telling me it's not maybe not going to be a full game? It's we supposed really to be on the level of Lost Legacy, Uncharted Lost Legacy. Like a smaller game. But still but dope. Again, dude. I don't know how much smaller Lost Legacy was in comparison, but it's not going to be stupid long. I think that that's I can cool. imagine them doing like so because they, they're catching so much flack for advertising like it's a full-on game. I can imagine them releasing a variety of DLC. I am also excited a variety that variety uh, of DLC that's going to make it equal up to more. Cyberpunk. Okay, so PlayStation Five. If you buy Cyberpunk on the PlayStation Four, you're automatically going to get it on the auto PlayStation upgrades, Five, right? That's right? So that's really cool. But if you buy the disc-based game, that's not possible, right? You'd have to buy hey, the digital version, obviously. I don't know. And then are they going to keep, I'm sure they're going to keep doing this like... No. <laughs> no. Dude, he's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> How can we make that sound <laughs> like a... Uh... <laughs> 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 yeah, so... I want that twisted metal. I heard they got a twisted metal potentially on the on the on the way, man. Where did you makes. hear that from? Are you just like, oh, wait a second? Are you just like putting your own thoughts and out into the universe so it'll come back to you, or did you actually see that somewhere? No, but that works too. <laughs> no, what I really seen there's a there's a twisted metal black startup cutscene before okay, you push yeah, the X yeah. button to start it up. Uh huh. There was the you can clearly see it was like PS2 graphics. Yeah. On one. And then I seen a present day remake of that startup. So that remastered. That literally has fresh. It's not remastered. It's a remake fully from the ground up. Okay, okay, okay. Is remastered now, is totally Jamie different Jaffe than the remake. Twisted Metal Black? That was the, the one that he didn't, I thought. Right? I don't know exactly. I thought that, that was the one he didn't work on. I don't know. I'm not sure about that one. I'm not sure who made that one. But I the PlayStation 3 Twisted Metal was the best. Dude, that, that just was a like re, the just best a remaster gameplay. of that would be. It just sucked the online enough. version, but everything else was great. No, about the game, online dude. was phenomenal too. No. Other than the fact that you they had their issues, to, yeah, they had their getting they into had, matches. The but fact we just they, can't, we just can't knock a game. No, no, all no, out. it was tight. The the game itself had the greatest physics physics engine a twisted metal has ever had. The PlayStation Three one. And pl I mean, playing it, online was straight. hella fun, but you had to do private. All of them were private matches. Well, it was private match. That's how it was. I know. The I problem really was, like the problem was, is like, they would show a fucking party, you go to start, you go to try to get in, and it would say, nah, you can't get in. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though there was no, it wasn't filled up. Yeah. So. And then you'd have to wait for the guy to, like, start the game. Oh, yeah, that because sucked. it had an automatic host, dude. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Yes, and so then if the guy was, like, away from the controller. Oh, dude, or dude, this, uh, the, guy, the guy left. 
Or like the guy that was hosting left and then he kicked it to some other guy. You didn't even know that they were hosting how yeah. to do it? Then I had to message him like, bro, you're a host, what are you doing? No, bro, we just came in here. Oh, 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 oh. thanks, bro. <laughs> <Dude, you have laughs> no and then started like, up. You even how to do it. Exactly. Um. <laughs> so, yeah, what another, what's another game that they... Ratchet and Clank is pretty dope. There you go. The new Ratchet and Clank is going to be cool. Yeah. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. I there mean, was just because it's a about classic it. PlayStation game, what was I it? think that that's pretty tight, dude. I was oh, like, the Crash Bandicoot, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why I was thinking um, Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet and Clank is what I said. Oh, oh, Not no. No, they got a Crash, dude. Oh, for real? They got a Crash, yeah. That was an announcement. They got a Crash, yeah. I'm see I seen it. They got... I don't uh, know where I seen it. I don't know where I seen it, but they got a Crash. New Crash. On the way. Sack boy. Yeah, big adventure, that. another little big planet game. Those games are always cool, like Mario type. I games. got some sack boy. <laughs> uh, what is this? A lot of stuff that I don't remember. Destruction All Stars is that like? Yeah, yeah. Destruction All Stars looks pretty crazy. It looks pretty cool. Doesn't show any, didn't show any gameplay, so it's kind of hard to see, like, how is that... Exactly. What, is there people running around? Yeah. You have to run them over? What's the point of the game? You can run them over. Well, the, the, only re the only reason people should be running around, I think, that I got from the trailer is because their car was exploded. Oh, I was thinking maybe... So now you can run around on foot, just try not to get exploded, but you can, you can like jump around from up above and try to land on people's cars and put a bomb on it and blow them up, whatever. So then how do you get your car back? How do you get your, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't see the damn gameplay, I just seen well, the damn on, trailer. Babe. You're supposed to know this stuff. You're the expert. I'm just the host. I just seen the trailer, man. I needed to watch it a couple times to really get a, an understanding, but I did watch it a couple times. I needed to maybe watch it a couple more times because I have no clue, like, how you get your car back or... If you're just on foot the rest of the game, but you still can win, so I guess. Um, Some gameplay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Oddworld. Another yeah. Oddworld game. Odd. That one looks pretty tight, dude. Those are always like cool little games. Uh, I have some other ones. The other one that looked really good that I liked. You should just be over also, here bringing it up or some shit on yours. Because this is what I would be doing, is I'd be on my PlayStation looking oh, it up yeah. and. and that's what you, Dude, what do you mean? This is you. This is yours. This is your job. No, I'm not. Okay, I'm then. The list here. You're the looker-upper. I'm the... Looker-upper. You hear that? <laughs> What's the technical term? Yeah, exactly. The explorer. The searcher. <laughs> searcher. The that's, seeker. That's pretty good. Um... Deathloop. Dude, did you see that game? Yeah, it looked pretty fire. That game is super tight, but I don't like that you have to start all the way back at the beginning. That's like not my thing at all. Mm. I don't like playing all the way through the game and then like, now you have to go all the way back to the beginning because you died and do it all over again. Yeah. So then do you do it exactly like you did? Or even if, like, was, if you were successful to that point, that's know, the thing that sucks that's about those. Like, then you gotta remember exactly what you did to like succeed? Mm. It's a brain memory? game. It's a brain game. I can maybe look at that. Like maybe the game's gonna make you smarter. All right, tell me, tell me a game. Uh, Death Loop. Fuck it, we'll just look at that one. Okay. Destruction All Stars gameplay. I think that's what we were trying to see. Uh, I already, that's fine. I already we'll seen that one. I already seen that. I mean, I've seen all these. I just want to see them again. This is the gameplay review. This game looks so dope, dude. Now, does it have a? It doesn't have a multi. If it had a multiplayer, that would like put it over Cyberpunk, the top. Cyberpunk, like, game of the year. Sub, 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 Lotus. How you doing, bro? Or Brodyette, Brodette. <laughs> uh, it is written. Okay, okay. That's cool, man. What about? Yeah, dude, Demon's Souls, that's gonna be a game that's on... Oh, there you go. Both yeah, dude. dude. Yeah, I feel it, man. There's a lot of people that are pumped on that Demon's Souls, brah. <laughs> Demon's Souls, 
Now that's a multi-flat game. Picture me trolling, ah. Uh, welcome back, how many days it's been a minute? Better. We'll see dude, they got Halo. Honestly bro, like I've been a PlayStation dude forever, but I'm gonna tell you right now, like, I've also loved me some Halo, and I don't really have a preference this coming up chin. Cause Sony kinda, Sony kind of been, uh, I don't know, bro, they, I, I need, uh, they won the generation, they didn't have to come out with any exclusives, they didn't come out with that, they didn't have to come out with any first party exclusives this whole generation, bro, that's what Sony didn't have to do, so they won the generation without even having to do anything but show up, you know what I mean, so, it makes me, it makes me think, but you know what, I do, there are some games that are PlayStation exclusives that have been good lately, Hunt. That's, that's not an exclusive, no, that's, on Xbox. that's on, on Xbox as well, yeah. And then, well these are just games, I'm just the maybe just seeing them games that like aren't really popular, but Hunt is a hell of a good game. Oh, you talking, hey that. Trellin, you talking about the, the current generation? Nah, I feel it bro. Honestly. Yeah. I feel you, bro. I'm not really worried about this generation, but um, I don't know. Yeah, we we have both consoles too. We have a PlayStation 4, PlayStation Pro, and an Xbox. So eventually, I yeah, got we'll 4K have, right course, now. So I'm of not course, really we'll sure. have both next generation too. But it's like, what do you want to start off with? Because you're not going to spend like a thousand dollars off the gate to get both consoles. Especially when we have to get two consoles already. Nah, so. I feel you trolling, but that's definitely not going to be the case. The reason why it's so big, bro, is because the motherfucker has a crazy cooling system. So, <laughs> people could be saying a lot of stuff, my man, but that's probably going to be misinformation right there just because it's so big. I don't know. That's dude, what she yours said. sounds like a dang airplane taking off sometimes, too, when that fan kicks on. Exactly. <laughs> Yeah, dude, like any system over it's here big, at this bro. point is like ridiculous because his pro. That's what 360 had a problem on. with. Like the fan kicks on, dude, and it sounds like an airplane is literally taking off in our living room sometimes. Yeah, dude. bro, like if a game was on right now, the PS4 Pro would be just mm, fucking taking <laughs> off, bro. Like taking off. <laughs> and that's not a knock because it's got to do what it's got to do to stay cool, but. Yeah, that's loud, man. It is, dude. Like, it's distractingly loud. <laughs> <laughs> the PS5, I'll say, looks better than the than the Xbox. Nah, you talking about down it's going to download slow? It's not going to download slow. That all bases off of, like, what your internet speed is, so... Did you put that on? We got... Nope. Oh wow, that's killer. Right. It's gonna be distracting. No. <laughs> that's not how PlayStation consoles work, bro. Right? Like it's gonna get slow. It's the way to be they do it, they age. unlock it. Yeah, they're gonna <laughs> unlock different things within the console because Sony always does that. They have extra power under the hood that they don't show that that they don't show or they don't let the the developers tap into until further down the road. So if anything, the console's gonna get faster. It's not gonna get slower. You know what I'm saying? Well, and I think it all depends on the game too. Like uh, yeah, PS4 is loud. You know what I'm saying? That definitely has something to do with the game, bro. Well, the, the disc drive, something. When the um, what game is it? Battlefront. That game takes forever to load on the PS4. Man, and the there's Xbox. so many games that take forever. So that's gonna be a big part of it. Oh yeah, what's that? What's wrong with the AMD, my friend? <laughs> I like AMD. Matter of fact, I thought I'm pretty sure AMD is working on both consoles. If I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure they're working on both consoles, right? Invested in a PC, like that's smart. <laughs> but you're gonna that's cap it like about. that's a lot of money to invest in a PC. No, nah, it's, it's smart to invest in a PC, but at the same time, like you're not gonna get the same stuff. You might be able to get some of the Xbox exclusives because they'll bring it over because it's Microsoft and Microsoft is PC related. But when it comes to PlayStation, 
PlayStation, you know, even thinking about that, you might be able to play some classics. You might be able to play some like some PlayStation 4 titles probably up up to PlayStation 4. I doubt that you guys on PC are going to end up getting PlayStation exclusives, but you know, you never know. But you never know because they are going more like PC and then systems like yeah, they dude. used to, dude. Like Hunt really. has, has long load times. It's definitely the best though. I love, I love me some Hunt Showdown, no doubt. Yeah. Yeah, but that's the problem, dude. Is I want to get new that's games. Like, why do I want? I want a PS5 for new games. I don't want to go and buy my all my old shit. You shouldn't have to buy none of your old stuff. That's what I'm saying. It should all be backwards compatible for PS4. Is what it's just what it's talking about. Yeah, unless you probably bought the, the problem with that thing. though is PlayStation. Uh, PlayStation 5 should be backwards compatible for all consoles. It should be backwards compatible for all the consoles. Yeah. All the way back Xbox to PS1. It's going to be backwards compatible for all of their past consoles. We'll see. We'll see. So if it's a digital version <laughs> of the system, then there's no way to put a disc in it at all. I know, huh? You can't get you that damn Sackboy game, huh? <laughs> Shucks. Nah, that's the realest though, bro. Like, they don't have... And, and I'm a PlayStation dude, like, man, I, I normally get excited every single generation to get the new consoles, you know what I mean? Because, like she said, it's just a matter of which one you're getting first type deal. But, for me, I'm just thinking PlayStation doesn't really have a ton of exclusives that I'm super hyped on right now. To buy the console at launch, you know what I mean? At launch like that. Especially when Cyberpunk is like the game that's Cyberpunk, coming out before man. the launch of any of them. So it's like, do I even want to buy a system off of the launch? Like, what are they giving me that I have to buy the system right away? Other than Xbox has Halo, dude. Like, that's the one that I would want to have at launch. I mean, that's you. That's great and stuff. I'd love to have a Twisted Metal on PlayStation for me. That's, that's just one thing. But I'm just saying what we I'm know just, coming out. I'm going to just tell you right now. Picture me, my boy, like... Mm. I seriously would go ahead and say this TV over here is bothering me because I'm on the screen over here. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, PlayStation exclusives are legit, bro. They're, they're literally legit. They're, they're normally super worth buying a PlayStation 4 just by itself. You got like all the PlayStation exclusives to, to rock with. But something this generation is telling me like, Bro, don't throw your money right into the console right away, dude. Well, because they were disappointing with the PS4. This PS4, this PS4, like, Sony didn't come out with no first-party exclusives, really. I mean, we could look it up. We could talk about Launch Uncharted. Games, like we could talk about Horizon. We could talk about, you know, the very, a couple of titles that they did come out with. But if we compare it to PS3 generation, like, they had MotorStorm, Kill Zones, Resistance, like, Twisted Metal. They had, like, so many games, bro. Mag, bro. They had... Bro, they had Ratchet and Clanks, like a ton of them. They had, dude, the list goes on and on and on on PS3. PS4 came around, bro, and because everybody bought this console, you know, it just, they didn't have to come out with no exclusives. They didn't have to come out with no exclusives. Dude, we're so excited for Cyberpunk, dude. That's like the game, the game to get. I wouldn't doubt it if games went up in price, dude. Like, they always, every generation, it seems like they go up in price. Mm. <laughs> I heard they're actually going to be staying the same, but I don't know. But the problem is, you got to get all the DLC. You're going to have to get him, babe. Hey, boy. <laughs> you have to get him. He's going to touch it. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Start him early, dude. <laughs> he like loves looking at himself. You see him on the TV? He's like, oh, oh yeah, yeah, dude. I'm loving this right now. <laughs> <laughs> Say rawr. 
<laughs> yeah, you already know. Yeah, shout out baby blue. You my boy blue! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, dude, but we're gamers to the core, man. <clears throat> we just got to wake people up <clears throat> and realize, like, if we want a variety of games, we got to literally support stuff, bro. We got to open our pockets, you know, and, and really start supporting these developers that are making stuff that's not rehashes, bro. Yeah. You know, I'm not hating on anybody buying any in particular game that comes out every year, every two years. But, like, think to yourself. There's a developer that wants your money, that needs your money, so they can continue business. If you continue to buy the same ass games every year, every two years, bro, like, you're not supporting them, man. You're not, you're not dishing the money out evenly, bro. Well, and that's what's frustrating even about, like, uh, place, like, Sony, like, stop giving me remastered games. Like, give me a new game. I would much rather you put time into like a new game and let me try it out than like giving me a remastered game. Bro, I'm so tired of seeing, and this goes for both consoles, bro. Because again, I'm not, I'm not, uh, you know, gonna exclusively hate on this console or other, bro. Yeah. I'm a gamer to the core, like I said already. But when you got Xbox and PlayStation not wanting to pay first-party studios to jump on and make. Like legitimate, it, like first party quality games. Us as gamers have to know the difference between a, a, a third party developer that's been signed on to make a console strictly for this game, which isn't gonna be a damn first party quality game. It's just gonna be a third party development team that's making a console that nobody else gets for a strict amount of time. That's all it really is. It's, it's, timed exclusivity and which it's, it's funny because like you said most good games are on all platform like that's ass backwards the good games should be the exclusives and the all platforms should be like the secondary go-to yes. don't do me on a favor consoles. on both consoles don't sign an exclusive deal with any third party studio nobody deserves to have any games stolen from either side first off again I don't I'm not really one of those to try to push this console over this console. I'm one of those guys like let us all get the best amount, of, like like the best games possible. Yeah. And in order for that to happen, first party exclusives need to be a thing. Like a real they battle. They need to be over what we want to spend our money on. That's what I'm. That's what I based my purchase on. Every single console from PlayStation One up to now. Yeah. Is being able to um, play the exclusives. From, from the various consoles. If, you have, if you're gonna have more exclusives on this one than that one that I wanna play, I'm gonna buy that console first. And then down the road, you know, a year or so into the generation, then I'll buy the, the other console. Yeah. But for me, like, this entire generation, and this, it brings me to the fact that Bloodborne is probably gonna end up being on the next Xbox. I'm sure it was a, a generation timed exclusive. I'm sure that the Xbox probably will end up getting to play Bloodborne at some point. Because I literally, I believe, is like a PC development squad that ended up making the exclusive for PlayStation. You know what I'm saying? So that's a timed exclusive. We're seeing things that Xbox made timed exclusives on 360 now on the PlayStation Store for the PlayStation 5, bro. You know what I mean? I mean PlayStation 4, I'm sorry. Which is Dead Rising. You know what I'm saying? The whole Dead Rising series. PlayStation fans didn't get to play Dead Rising, the 360 and PS3 generation, because it was timed exclusives. Because Sony caught on, man. So Microsoft was doing it. They was paying third-party developers to make exclusives. Sony started doing it. So it's just a battle of let me buy this console. How many? Or let me let me buy, buy this development. Yes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> let, oh, you have a good idea in the works. I like the pipeline. that game coming out. Let me buy it from you. <laughs> let me get. Let me give you some cash. You just go ahead and bring it over to our console. We'll pay you. We're gonna we're gonna dish out the cash. And if, as a development standpoint, you can't be mad at that. It's like, yo, let me get the money. We're gonna get the money from the gamers as well on this console, and the next generation will release it on that console, and then they'll we'll be able, we'll be able to get more money from that from those fans as well. So you're just uh, being, time, being able to double and triple dip is what it no, is. No, but it doesn't because a lot of times it puts a, like a dirty taste in your mouth. 
that like they left my console out. Like it happens every time. Either console. The fans Please of that TV. console are like, dude, why did you leave my console out? Like you just let them buy me Lawbreakers, like Lawbreakers, you know, Cliff Blazinski, the gears maker, bro, he actually ended up making an exclusive for PS4 this generation called uh, Lawbreakers. He was gonna bring it over to the um, <clears throat> what you call it to the to the uh, Xbox, but <clears throat> nobody supported it in time, so they couldn't bring it over. They it's were getting with them. Well, it, originally it was supposed to be Xbox and PlayStation. PlayStation bought it, and then a lot of Xbox fans were mad because of you already know Patron. Because of the because they had come out with games on Xbox already, so they were kind of pissed. You gotta grab them, baby. Nope. Hey. Ah. Yeah, no, I think no, I thought that's what Demon I'm Souls saying, bro. was going to be Lord. on both of them, actually. I thought I saw it on the list of both the Xbox and the S and the PlayStation 5. Yeah, I don't have any but idea. I'm, that's just the remastered Are you talking version? About, no, he's talking about Bloodborne. No, oh, no, no. oh, I see oh, that. Uh, Shame, yeah. Demon Souls will probably be, be yeah, yeah, who knows? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be, yeah, we have no clue. Yeah, dude, but... I mean... It just sucks when they do that, because then, yeah, people miss out on games. It, it's actually, I think, harder on the developer, because then more people aren't getting to try it, but I can see it's like a for sure thing for the developer to make their oh, money Oh, the money back. in the pocket. Yeah, exactly. It's like, or this, this company, Sony or Xbox, you know what I mean? Microsoft, rather is going to pay for the development, you might as well jump on, you know yeah. what I mean? But it's just not a good look for us gamers. It's not a good look. Just like only buying, you know, if you're going to play shooters, spread the love, you know? Hunt is a fantastic shooter, you know? There's a lot of people that are stuck on, and I could appreciate it somewhat, having free shooters to play and free games to play and having a, um, a series, a shooter that, that I want to play, you know, I'm, I'm super into, but you just, you got to support, we got to support the masses, bro. We got to support great games when they drop, because otherwise we're not going to get them. Do, you, do we like options? If we like options, we got to spread our money around. If we don't spread our money around, our options are going to run dry, bro. Well, we have to voice, like, voice our concerns, too, to, like, Sony, dude, and and Microsoft, like, we want more exclusives that are real exclusives. I want games that are good that are, like, built for my system, dude. Yeah, well, that's the thing. Exactly. Show them what the console can do. Why do you buy a console if you can't see what it can do? Uh, a lot of people don't realize PS3 actually had a, a ton of power under the hood, and people didn't get to see the power under the hood until later on in the generation, so... Because... Consoles hold consoles back, and that's just the way that that's just the way gaming goes, you know. PlayStation Four may have, may have been holding back Xbox this gen. I don't know, you know. I'm not on that side of things, so I can really tell you all like enough. So, you know what I mean? Oh, 4K runs slow. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Don. Yeah, bro. She's out of town, bro. She's actually out of state. I think she's in Arizona. <laughs> Yes, dude. Every generation, like, all so many sequels. And that's fine, but, to but me, come out with other shit, too. Like, just don't just do the sequels. It's not about sequels. Like, we like like we don't even need sequels that much. But we do need classics. We need classics to be, to be made. I understand one of new IPs. I'm a big fan of new IPs, but I know Sony has a huge portfolio. So there's games that they can be pulling out that they've slacked on that they need to pull out of the portfolio, bro. We need to be seeing MotorStorm, like a, a, a new version of MotorStorm. We need to be seeing Twisted Metal. Another Resistance game might be fire, bro, as long as they're not making the spawn system trash like they did on Resistance 3. Because the stories were phenomenal on all three of those Resistance games. And I even heard the, the PSP version was legit. So... We just need them. And Killzone was lit, dude. dude. I Killzone, still miss Killzone. I'm Killzone just 2 and 3 that, is, fa is a fantastic game. Shadowfall, Shadowfall the, was... the hit detection was trash. And once again, the spawning system is terrible, bro. Even though it spawned you in, like, a uh, like room, it was still whack, dude. 
I know, Don. What are they doing, bro? Don't even show footage of a damn game that's already on this console and present P it like it's new. It was a PS3 game, dude. They Bruh. showed. They opened the PS5 with a PS3 game. And I love me some GTA, but people are getting excited about that. Dude, like, why wouldn't you show that at the end? That to me, that's not an opener. That's not an opener game. Bruh. A PS3 game? You opened your PS5 with a PS3 game? Come on, dude. Yo, trolling, bro, are you crazy, my man? We're all getting 4K 30 frames per second. Do you realize, bro? These cock diesels literally been promising us 4K 60 frames for fucking two generations now, bro. Like, I believe it when I see it. You know what I'm saying? We, they better be hitting 60 frames next generation. If they're not hitting 60, 4K 60 frames, bro, like... Let's all go to PC. Like, no, they, dude, do you remember when we called Sony because uh, God of War um, Ascension? Like, remember it said 1080p on the box, and at no time in the game did it say like it switched over to like 780 every time, constantly, because our TV would constantly tell us that it was like 780. So then we called Sony, like, what the heck, dude? It says 1080, but there's no nothing in 1080. They're like, oh, some of the cutscenes are in 1080. Do you remember that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, that's how they do shit for now. It's like, oh, yeah, it's gonna be in 4K, but it's like, dude, what really is gonna be? Nah, in 4K? TVs are capable, bro. I can send you a picture if if I had you added on my PlayStation right now. That says my TV and even the PlayStation, because if you go to the, uh, I forget what it is, but if you go to settings in your PlayStation 4 menu. You can see it'll tell you what your capabilities are for your TV. My TV literally says it could do 4K 60, bro. You know what I mean? So, and if it was supported, I could do 120 if I'm not mistaken. Because I did I get this one? Was that the TV that I you got the TV? best one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because the 45 didn't support the FreeSync or the uh, what is it? I, it was FreeSync or it was. FreeSync, uh, yeah. Yeah, the 45 me. inch didn't hit the precinct, so then you had to upgrade to the bigger one. Exactly. Yeah, that's what you got. Is that what you got? That's what I'm talking about, Don. Yeah, dude, exactly. Mine definitely can be uh, 60, bro. Yeah, Samsung Q90, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what the fuck I got, man. No way, is it? I don't know, dude. It's a, it's a Samsung. I don't remember, bro. It's the best one for like, now yeah, or bro. whatever. Until like 8K came out like a month ago or whatever. But I'm not spending five grand on a TV, so. Oh, you already know stress, d distress. I mean, you know, if you got that. Oh, you said 144 hertz. What's wrong with that, bro? Isn't that like double the speed? But you know what's funny though is that the reaction time that you want the reaction time, you have to put the late like. You can't have a... Uh... Nah, we can't say they have to sacrifice. PC can max shit out, bro. PC can literally be rocking max settings, bro, when it comes to resolution as well as, like, even faster, like 120 hertz type shit, bro. Do, we ha do you have to sacrifice your resolution for your speed or no? Because you have Nah, to... but certain games will give you that option, which they're supposed to be doing that a lot next generation where the, you could either be priming your game for max resolu resolution or, or max frame rate. So you that's know what, I do weird. like that they give you that option, dude. That's really dope. That God of like War did that. that. Yeah, exactly. God of War did it, of course. Yeah, yeah. She's got the, what the fuck is that? The Vizio motherfucking crazy shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's up, bro? <laughs> X. That's my dog. You know what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> Oh, I would definitely, there's no doubt about it, I gotta get the disc drive, bro. I'm, I'm a big movie buff, and I got a movie collection, so I want to be able to watch my stuff on that. Well, the thing is, is like, when we get a system, we use it for, like, our whole entertainment center, like, all in one. So, if we're gonna get, if we're gonna spend the money, like, you might as well spend the money to get the disc drive, like, everything that you could possibly come, it could come with, you know what I mean? It's like getting a car, yeah. getting the luxury edition oh, of yeah, the car yeah. versus like the basic bitch model. Like if sometimes, you're gonna, like, if you're gonna spend the 30k, you might as well spend the 40k and get you, you the best one, bro. Get you the LS. So you you know get the saying? fucking cup holders and the seat the warmers sport, and shit. You know <laughs> We can't say only ones on PS5 would be certain ones would be cable. We can say that on and damn anyone, right? Goodness gracious. 
Yeah, yeah. Oh, I got you, X, bro. Yeah, yeah. Strictly game, bro. I mean, there ain't no, there ain't no discs. There ain't no disc version of any games that you would want to play from P4 on your P5. Or do you buy, do you buy strictly, uh, what you call it, bro? Strictly fucking uh, digital. Thank you, fucking. Dude. <laughs> no, but you know what sucks about that? I'll tell you something. Is that the PlayStation has no longer you can you buy digital versions at GameStop, which doesn't seem like that big of a deal, but it is because some games give gives GameStops uh, extra DLC content. Like with Madden, they had an extra pack that you could download with their digital content, but because PlayStation doesn't support that anymore. Oh my you can't gosh, bro, I hate get that. that. So you have to, you, like, you're stuck with just whatever Sony decides to give you and you don't get any special packages that potentially GameStop could get, right? So that that really sucks if you only have the digital version, then you have to do that. I don't even know how we like wiggled our way and got you got the like DLC, dude, but that's just how we end up always doing shit, dude. Yeah, yeah, bro. That's what, that's what I'm saying. You talking about? Oh, well, you talking about the Destiny dose? Are you what are you talking about, bro? For the P5 or what? This is Lucas. Lucas Aurelius. I was pregnant with him because I'm sure some of you remember. Exactly. Like loading times are supposed to be seamless, where exactly. you don't even notice stuff and stuff like in the future and everything like that. So. Yeah, we we do too. We we're able to we, we share a lot of our stuff together as well. So we uh, we buy a lot of digital, bro. Like almost all our games are digital because then he could share it with me. But then su that sucks too sometimes because now they're making it to where some of the content isn't. Oh yeah, you got to double buy DLC, bro. Crazy. Which we never had to do before. Oh, he's a, he's a big Dude, boy. He's a big. He's baby. a big boy. He's 10 months old. <laughs> this is a 10 month old. Like, he's big, dude. <laughs> this guy trolling, man. <laughs> uh. <laughs> That's hilarious, bro. Yeah, dude. But, uh. Trolling, my man. Trust me, the PS5 ain't gonna have no crazy load times. It's bro. you know it's gonna be. It's just I just don't want like buyer remorse. I think is my like, and it sucks. Well, if you don't I want that, like, then you better just make sure you wait till there's enough exclusives. Cause uh, but that's the problem, dude. Like I want to play Halo right out the gate. Like there's some games you got to be on the gate or else like he's not. Well, he was a nine pounder when he popped out. He was nine pounds even. This kid. Twenty one inches. <laughs> Yeah, no, I feel you, bro. <laughs> uh, that midlife crisis upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> no, but doesn't that's actually funny because Sony and like Xbox, they always have their. their oh my like, gosh, I'm gonna. Oh, they're gonna come out with some. Oh my gosh, I, I gotta, gotta hold back something. a little bit because you know the pros gonna be coming out like the the better version. The Scorpion's gonna be coming out. Come on, motherfucker. You already like, know, Cali Game. Appreciate you. Give me you. the best at the at the beginning, dude. Why are you holding back on me just to like improve it later on? You're whack. Or at least let us know, like, hey, by the way, in six months, where are you gonna be coming out with an well, even better console? Well, that's why I'm not. I think gonna get one right off bat, and and if I do get a console right off bat, I wouldn't mind getting the Xbox probably just because I don't really care if I got the I, as long as I got next gen on the Xbox, I'll be fine. I can play the Halo and shit. But for P5, bro, I want to get the best possible console drop. If I can get the PS5 Pro, I'm gonna I'm gonna scoop that one when it drops. Whatever they call it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, PS5 Pro. I'm gonna yeah. I'm, I'm gonna scoop that one when it drops, bro. Probably, cause I I messed up. Pinch hitting my dog. What's going down, bro? I messed up, cause I ended up upgrading from my I got PS4 right away, like that, bro. Like a, literally like a month or so after the damn console dropped, and so I was stuck with the damn console. It seemed like there was no games, bro. Like we did end up getting like 2K and shit. Like it had a couple like 2K16, I think or something. I don't know, bro. We had Shadowfall. We was... had 2K, which came with the console. Oh yeah, yeah, exactly. We bought it like 
We bought a back roads oh, console. I, hey, I got it off the street, bro. <laughs> Dude, we got it so cheap. It was what, it was like a four hundred dollar console. We got it for two hundred twenty five dollars, dude. Yeah, bro. It was like <laughs> right off the street. And you, it was jacked, as you know, damn well. The guy probably snuck in somebody's window. Oh man! Don't style. even say that. Why would into you his do pocket, that? Yeah. Like, really bad karma on me because I bought that thing. No. No, we didn't steal the fucking thing. I just bought the damn thing on a deal. That don't give me bad karma. <laughs> uh, I know he's huge, dude. He really is big, dude. He's like the size of an 18 month old, the doctor said, but he's like hella tall, too, so. <laughs> what, exactly. Why dude. would I buy it if I'm not going to open it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, pinch it and what's up, dude? <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm telling you, bro. Uh, but man, oh man, there you go, fire, bro. Yeah, yeah exactly. for me, dude, I'm probably gonna wait and just get the PS. I'm probably get PS5 Pro, bro. We'll probably, honestly, we'll probably start off getting an Xbox because it comes out with Halo. And honestly, all I, I just want to get Cyberpunk, bro. Like when Cyberpunk Cyber... is gonna be so dope, dude. There's not really any other games I'm super hyped on right yeah, now dude. other than Cyberpunk. So Keanu Reeves is gonna be like my homie. We're gonna be rolling deep in the fucking cars, dude. That game's gonna be so tight. I hate to even get like so hyped in my mind of like what it's gonna be because I don't want to be disappointed. But really, dude, I'm super hyped on that game. Like, it's been I can't in development for a excited. long time. The, the game looks ill, dude. It looks really crazy. It got pushed so. back again, if nobody else knows like that. you It has got pushed yeah, back it's, again. It's going to be in September now, so... But at the same time, I'm not I'm worried about that too much because like, I want the game to be ready. When it's out, I want it to be good and ready to go. I don't want it to like have any problems and then people hate it because it was fucked up. All that shit, you know what I mean? What so, the game? This, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't. I I try to just. I try to just hold it, man. <laughs> no, but you know what? The spice of life is like getting excited about shit, getting hyped about shit. Don't. I learned not to get excited. No, about dude, shit. no, you can't do that because you gotta get excited. You gotta get hyped on shit, dude. You gotta get excited about it. Hey, that Avengers point. looks fire, bro. Oh, dude, Avengers, dude. I did see that on there. That's kind of dope, dude. But I'm. I mean, it's Tyrone, a movie what's game. Up, bro? Callie, that's right. Exactly, Fire Lord. <laughs> Dang, kid. I know, dude. Like What's up with that bottle, my man? It like crazy. <laughs> you know what? He's just sucking all air. Let me make him a real one. Yeah, man. So that's what it is, bro. Hey, I'm going to tell you right now, X, dude. You're missing out not getting that hunt, man. Hunt Showdown is fire, bro. Anybody that don't have Hunt Showdown is sleep right now, bro. What about the Predator? Oh yeah, Predator's fire as well, too. Predator's a fire-ass game, too. Oh, you already know Ghost of Tsushima looks dope, bro. My bad, yeah, bro. You already know Ghost, Ghost of Tsushima looks dope, bro. <clears throat> That's the one, because I know there was two. There was two. So I'm trying to make sure. I'm pretty sure the Ninja one that was... On both consoles already dropped, didn't it? And then and then Sony had announced the other the other like samurai game, which is the Shima, right? Because if that's the one, the Ghost of to, to Shima looks fire, bro. That was the one I was like, bro, that Sony exclusive uh, samurai game, hyped on that, bro. Well, it's pretty the fire. Ghost of Tsushima game is the one where he has the fucked up hand. Is that that one, or is it the other one? Yeah, you already know, Fire Lord. <laughs> oh, there you go, Don. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm telling you, bro. It's got to be it, man. Yeah, Tsushima. Yeah, that's the exclusive, bro. Yeah, that one. That one looked fire, bro. That one. That one. They looks both lit. look. The, both those samurai games look hella tight, dude. They were both different, and like they both look yeah. tight, dude. I'm gonna give me another drink and be right back. <laughs> And that Skull and Bones, dude, I'm excited. Does that game even have a date on it yet? Nah, bro. Dude, that Skull and Bones, like, I don't know about you guys. It just looks hella different and, like, fun, dude. Like, oh, one of the best parts of, like, that Assassin's Creed, Creed was the, the ship and, like, 
doing all that sh like shit, dude. So Skull and Bones is gonna be like super tight. They fucked dude. up and they were trying to come out with some probably super like mega transaction. Oh yeah. Yeah, because they fucking. What was it, bro? For Honor came out with crazy transactions. So I can imagine that. Um, uh, they were trying to do the same thing. The witch call was trying to do the same thing. So they had to push it back so that way they can fucking straighten themselves out. We're from the United States. We're here in California. I know, dude, but UBs, you know what's cool about UBs? They have so many different things, like such a variety of games that they put out. Bro, man, it's fucked up because I was sticking up for UB at, at like, not even that long ago, it felt Just like, Just like the last E3 you were sticking up for because their shit looked tight, dude. Yeah, man, but... But then they, they messed it up. You know what? It, it really disappoints me that UB owns the right to the driver series, bro, and they're just not doing anything with it. Uh, because they they're coming out with and no no it. offense to anybody that damn likes the the games but that watchdogs like that watchdogs like they they're developing a hell of those rather than like giving us a driver bro like let me get a damn driver bro or some shit dude that's what I'm saying like they make that other driving game who makes that other driving yeah, game yeah they do so do you think that they use, does it feel like they use their physics engine in that? Nope. The driver physics engine? Nope. I don't think so. It's too it slidey, look, bro. Like, yeah. It's too, like, and driver's actually real when it comes to the drift and shit. But with that game, like, when you can turn your car like this and it's not really going anywhere, like, that's not driver, bro. That's yeah, not real yeah, physics yeah. engine. Driver's got an ill-ass physics engine. Gran Turismo, you already know, bro. Gran Turismo's been fire and shit. They did come out with that Gran Turismo Sport, which... As kind of like, it wasn't a full on Gran Turismo title, so I don't know, bro. Motherfuckers are pulling sneaky shit, trying to give us, I don't know, crumblets. <laughs> bro, let me just get the whole fucking, let me get the whole chip, bro. Like, let me get the whole bag. You're just dropping me some crumblets and shit. Yeah, I'm, dude. I'm tired of crumblets. Like, why are you baby giving it, like, like barely giving us games? Cali. Tyrone. <laughs> yeah, man. There's a difference between like, and, and that's the thing, giving us baby games, what she means by that is like a baby amount of games, right? Yes, like not that many, like you're not giving us the exclusives, like... Or when you do the, give us an exclusive, it's like a taste of it, it's like, oh that's a cool taste bro, but if I had a whole damn dessert or a whole damn meal of that shit, it would have been great. I'm just trying like to... Miles like Miles Morales bro, like, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, exactly. They're presenting that as like Lost Le Uncharted Lost Legacy. So, why are you, I don't know, you're just showing me titles that aren't even full-on titles. Yeah, exactly. So, that's just kind of disappointing. It's disappointing when it's like, oh, we have three, three games, <laughs> three major games coming out. I'm telling you, watch, bro. I'm going I'm, I'm to look it up right now, bro. That Twisted Metal, bro. Where's the shit at? They got the Twisted Metal, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Remastered. It's, it's not remake. remastered, man. It's still the, not the same. It's not the same as a new game. It's not, but it's... I mean, if they brought motherfucking Twisted Metal fucking from P3, it wouldn't need to be a brand new game. It would just need to be a remaster, see? And then we've been bitching about remastered so much that like, fine, they don't want a remaster. Yes, we do, motherfucker. Give me a remaster of the PS3 Twisted Metal and we're in the money. I might All buy right, your stay, console have at a good launch. Night. <laughs> hey, X, hit us, Dob. <laughs> Twisted Metal Black remake. Dude, your son is like. He should be in bed right now. That's right. <laughs> yes, Twisted Metal Black Remake Dow. But it's not going to have a... Or is it going to have a multiplayer? Hmm? Is it going to have multiplayer? Like, where are all my multiplayer games? Come on, bro. I know. Somebody's been slacking on that Dude, they shit. don't come out with, like... Come on, God of War is a dope-ass game, but it doesn't have multiplayer. Like, Spider-Man, hella dope, not multiplayer. Unfortunately, the teaser has been taken down. Recommended waiting until tomorrow for full review. Reveal. But yeah, right, bro. When was that written? How many days ago? <laughs> it was fucking the beginning of June. Like right before, it was the day before the Sony announcement. Oh, uh, okay, okay. 
I don't know, dude. Something else was, was like. They're nah, not but really normally. An, it's not really. To me, it wasn't an announcement because they didn't tell us everything that they had. So it's like. Yeah, but you need normally to when they got a game that, that that drops out like that, like on some some leakage, then normally it, it does end up coming to fru to fruition, bruh, to fruition. Fusion. Fruition. <laughs> Two different words together, dude. Don't try to play it off like you meant to say that. <laughs> Fruition, man. <laughs> Did you yes. really mess with Twist? Did you really get down on Twisted Metal Black? Or? No. That's what's fire actually about it. Cause they gave us Twisted Metal Black for free when we bought Twisted Metal P3, PS3. But yeah, exactly. Like, <laughs> you gotta get one, dude. Eventually. I mean, I wouldn't say get it in December, but you know, it is what it is. I don't know. For me, bro, if it's a Twisted Metal man, we have to see, bro. We'll have to see, dudes. Uh, that's the thing. Is if they announced a game that I really wanted to play, like I would get the shit at launch, but they haven't, so that's my problem right now. Like, just tell us what the games are. It's not that far away. I'm inside. I have nothing to freaking do. Like, we're st we're all stuck in here. Give us something to talk about. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I hope you guys all have long weekends. Fourth of July. Oh, he's showing off his shoes. <laughs> Just a little LeBron's. LeBron 17s. <laughs> the Raiders. <laughs> so excited that they're in Vegas, dude. And we're so going to the draft in 2022, dude. I'm fucking gonna be there, dude. I'm so excited. We were gonna go this year. Obviously, it was canceled. Everybody knows yeah, that. Yeah, bro. We were about to be at the draft, we bro. Go, we were gonna go. We were ready. Man, we I'm booked our hotel. You, we we all had it ready to go, dude. Then they said, oh, oh, canceled. No draft in Vegas. No! Dude, but now we'll be there in 2022. Yeah, bro. Some long off. It is like you know what time goes by so fast. It's like I'm not even gonna wish for it to be here because no. it'll fucking like wake up and then tomorrow it'll be time nah, for the draft. I'm trying to yeah. Yeah, let me enjoy my time. Exactly. Man, with the Raiders, bro, we got we're building, bro. We got crazy. We're we're built right now. Shouldn't even say we're building, bro. We're built, bro. Raiders are built. This oh, that's Luke. what? That's Lucas right there. Lucas. Lucas Aurelius. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, baby. He's part of the stream tonight. <clears throat> Dude, he's a little monster is what he is. I mean, literally, he growls and everything. Huh. <laughs> Yeah, buddy. The cuties, yeah. Yep, Lucas. What is he doing? Oh no, he's chilling. <laughs> ah, he was doing that oh, earlier. Oh, so that he's box, crying. that box is all in the way. Uh, oh, am I pushing it? That. He must have just uh, push the things, to push the flaps down. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, my controller. Yeah, babe. Twisted Metal came out with the original PlayStation. Like, why wouldn't they just drop a new whole new Twisted Metal with the PlayStation 5? Just keep it going with that. You know what I mean? 
Don't ask me, man. It's not me making. It's not me using the money up to make games. Cause if it was, it would be a brand new twisted, or at least the twisted metal from PS3. I don't know why. You know what? There was some kids that started complaining, like, "Oh, twisted metal black was super dark." Blah blah. I love twisted metal black, and it's, and it was super dark, and it's just like. Bro, do you realize the PlayStation 3 Twisted Metal was killer, bro? It was like the greatest physics that a Twisted Metal ever had, bro. The well, illest graphics, like destructible environments, a thousand miles an hour, bro. Like the most competitive fucking game you'll play, bro. Multiplayer was just so tight, dude. I'm telling you, bro. For motherfuckers that like tough games, like people that like hunt and shit. Bro, Twisted Metal, you can't go wrong with Twisted Metal on PS3. That game was beyond fire, bro. So, yeah, let's talk about what games uh, that you had to grind <laughs> on, like, this last generation, dude, and that we don't want to do that next generation. Oh, uh, bro, I don't know what's up with the grinding, bro. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of grinding myself. Like Destiny 2, like when it first came out, I hella liked it, dude, and then it just like turns into a chore where it's like I gotta play this every day so that I can get my my shit, I can get my upgrades, so then I can get my other upgrades. It's like they just keep you hanging on, you're chasing your carrot all the time. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I don't know what's I don't know what what's up with that, man. Even Madden. like Ultimate Team, like they. Oh yeah, you, you gotta live on those games, dude. <laughs> if you're not spending money. Like, you have to stay on the one game. One game. And I think that maybe that's because they keep you feeding you, like, oh yeah, all this stuff, like, onto one game. You got to keep doing Like, if you want to if you want to build a team without spending money, you, you got to grind your life away. Yeah, exactly. Yo, what up, Dave, bruh? Much love, my man. You already know. Cheers, Dave. Hmm? City of Trees. What city is that? <laughs> Boys and Sack, dog. Oh, is that what that is? That's just City of Trees. Oh, you just know that. That's just the thing to know. That's, that's Dave, bro. I know Dave. <laughs> okay. We're on the network. He's on the oh, network. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Hell yeah, Dave's the shit. It's my dog, bro. That boy's a consistent streamer, for real, for real. So what was your favorite game on PS4 that you wish that they did bring to, like, a new version of it to PS5? I don't know, bro. Are you just, like, mm. asking for, it's not going to be over there because it's all digital? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Or is there anything at all that you would want? I'm simple, bro. What's up, Myers? Indiana. Yo, yo, Indiana in the easy. What up? You already know. <laughs> Davis the shit, bro. It's going good, my friend. How you doing, bro? We're just chilling. Talking but, about uh, games. Exactly, dude. But me, man, I'm thinking of like classics they could bring back, bro, like Siphon Filter. What about uh, Mag? That shit's fire. Mag is definitely... Okay, if there was one game that you could wish out of Jet all Moto's the consoles... Jet Moto's the shit right now, what bro. What would it be? What would the one game be that you would wish that they brought to the PS5? Just one choice that you could choose from all the consoles. Mm, twisted Metal. It would be Twisted Metal, not Mag. Mm. I'm crazy surprised that it would not be Mag. Well, that's the thing, bro. Like, Mag, like, I don't know. It's one thing to want another version, but I've seen what it's like to want a game to get a version that's called like a game that's called that, but it's not really that. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, if somebody can say, oh, I want a Twisted Metal. Oh, they got Twisted Metal. Guess what? Twisted Metal. I mean, not Twisted Metal. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, I want a Killzone. Killzone. Oh, they got a Killzone Shadowfall. Yeah. Okay, Killzone Shadowfall is not even a Killzone. Like, get, get up out of here, right? I like, want a shooter, though. It's a Killzone. It's the universe, but it's not It's not on the level. It's not Killzone 2. It's not Killzone 3. Now, when you play Killzone 2 or play Killzone 3 multiplayer, then you know what I'm talking about. Apex is cool, but at the same time, like, the, the uh, what is go. it called? The, um, 
where they're battle royale. Like that's not really my thing, dude. Yeah, she ain't really into battle royale, but I'm fucking with battle royale. Battle royale is a real, um, some competitive shit. That's some real hardcore competitive shit. Fallout Three, dude, like. My kids on that game so vicious. I haven't found like, oh my gosh, the greatest fucking, you know, battle royale game to race the planet yet. Like there, there definitely is room for like there, there to be a better version of a battle royale out there, in my personal opinion. But I don't know, dude. I just, I don't really, it's just not my game. H one Z one is actually a pretty fire ass like game, bro. A little, for a pretty fire ass battle royale. I like that it's like gives a variety of something to everybody, but at the same time it's like me like a shooter. You come out with like a even Halo could do battle royale, bro. Yeah, of course, Call of Duty did it. Everybody could do it. I don't want a battle royale. There's nothing wrong. Okay, I don't care if you want it. It's a it's a mode. It is. Yeah. It's like oh, big yeah, team. Yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. team deathmatch. Yeah. It's like it, that's what that's what battle royale is. They don't need to have an entire game. Centered around battle royale. Yeah. You just need it to be a game mode that's offered. Yeah. I just wish it was like battle royale is, is is more than fucking. It's better than having like a one v one v one like type deal, and everybody just keeps killing and respawning, killing and respawning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's more strategy to it. There's more skill to it. There's more competitive. It's more of a you gotta think through every single move. Yeah. That's what makes damn hunt so crazy. Yeah, dude, that, Maybe, yeah. that uh, Fallout 76, like, I, mean, I heard you that know, people didn't like that I don't know. as much I, I didn't, I didn't, I'm not a big Fallout fan, so I wouldn't know, but yeah, Fallout 76, I already knew when it was dropping, it wasn't going to be what Fallout fans were expecting or used to. Yeah, so. exactly. But again, that's not knocking the game, because I know there's a lot of people that like it, I just haven't really fucked with it. <laughs> Dub C... <laughs> oh, I love Friday the 13th. Friday. Myers 1231, bro. You already know, dude. You already know. Friday the 13th is the shit, dude. I know. Anybody that have an experience, anybody that hasn't experienced Friday the 13th is missing out. And I don't know if they dropped the price on it, but I think it's on the discounted games right now, so people that don't have it should potentially check into that if you can get it for cheap. Yeah, but uh, yeah. Friday the 13th is a fire ass game, especially if you have people that you can play with, you guys can strategize yeah. and shit, you guys can really work together and, and whoop Jason's ass, bro, like that shit's fun, bro. I'm actually working on a picture right now for my son for his birthday. It's 20 nah, bucks right now. You gotta go back, you gotta go back, there's a deal going on right now. Well, I don't have PlayStation Plus, so it's probably not gonna show Push you. circle. Oh, well, see, that's what I'm saying. Right there, multiplayer discount, yes. 70%. Nah, go to that, yeah, multiplayer discount, yeah. Sometimes what's crazy is they'll show you a discount on the discount screen, but they won't show you the discount on the game screen. On the game. So then when you go to buy the game, are you, they don't automatically add that? You, like, have to buy the discounted one? Like, find it on yeah. here? Yeah. And how come it's not in alphabetical order, which would be way more, like, Easy yeah, I don't know if it's even on here. No, no. <laughs> That's a good game. It like had me on the edge the whole time. That Contra, that Contra looks pretty crazy. Ah. Rawr. Ah. What the heck, did they have a Vichy game? Yeah. What are all these games like? Oh, uh, you, you mess with Jenny? Yeah, yeah, I, I like the, uh, damn, I forget what her name <laughs> is, man. Uh, what's her name, bro? The black chick on there, bro. She's hella fat. She got hella stamina, bro. Like, that's the chick I always play with. Huh? Her name's 
What? Tiffany? Yeah, yeah, Tiffany? No, 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 not Tiffany. That's not Tiffany, bro. Tiffany's Yeah, yeah. Tiffany's the other chick. Hurry up. Hurry up what? Go down. <laughs> no, no. No, oh, it ain't there. Rawr. Ah. Rawr. <laughs> Rawr. 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 <laughs> oh my goodness, babe. <laughs> So ready to get we're going camping tomorrow. I'm ready to get out of here. Oh, you tripping, bro. Cali got the kill kill. <laughs> and I don't know about this Cali, but I'm talking about California. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm sure Cali has it. I mean, if he's in Cali, he's probably got the, 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 the Cali kill. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, exactly. Hey, 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 no, no. I told you. Rawr. 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 Look, kid. Rawr. Rawr. <laughs> <laughs> drink, 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 drink. Lime. Is it good? Yeah, with this extra shit I added there. What'd you add to it? Get, get a red. <laughs> get the red. <laughs> get the red. <laughs> That's what I have, is that Gatorade. Did you make it sweet? So you put sugar in it, basically. No, my shit has like 1%. 1% on carbs on, the, on the, the drink that I bought. 1% is how many milligrams? Well, not 1%, bro. 1 gram. Oh, okay, Damn there it. you go. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. 1% could be a lot more than you think that it is. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, okay, I got you. Hey, you guys, I know you guys got that cheese out there, bruh. I know you guys got that cheese. But nah, out here in Cali, bro, we got that kill, man. <laughs> so, what about that Horizon? Horizon? You know, Horizon was a game that I was really excited about. You know, I played some of I played some of it. Hey, no no. You know they're coming out with a new horizon for the PlayStation. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. Horizon was a cool game. It was good, you know, from what I've played of it, it was it was fun. It was obviously slow, it was extremely slow, so I didn't get around to beating it, but I haven't beaten Days Gone fully yet either, so that doesn't say a lot. I know, but that's lot, so weird so. how like obviously they use the same physics as and Horizon, dude. They're just so similar to each other, kind of like... Mm, I don't know about that. They are. What do you mean? The whole game plays They're two totally different stories. And different weapon types. Same gameplay. Different oh, weapon like types. You gotta take the bush apart and put the other types. You can say the same thing for Uncharted and Last of Us 2. Uncharted yeah. 4 and Last yeah, of Us 2. Yeah, they obviously two. use the same thing for that too. Yeah. They even kind of look the same. Like <laughs> movie style, like game, kind of like when you feel like you're in the game. Mm -hmm. Like you feel like you're playing a movie basically when you're playing the game. Uncharted was always jump with that shit, dude. It's like I'm watching you play, I'm watching a movie. Except he's like searching for stuff for an hour that doesn't normally happen in a movie. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. 
I mean, yeah, the game was cool though. The story was tight. The cutscenes were badass. The missions were fun. Ooh, what about that Godfall? Did you check that game out? Lucas. Because it looks like a God of War style game. Let me see the control. Yeah, no, I've seen some, i seen like a quick little piece of gameplay. Put that on for me. Let's see if it's going to come on here. It's not. It could. The other one did. What? Another game that I searched. No, it didn't. Uh, you don't know that. Oh, they got Godfather? What do they got? They got the, Oh, they got that Godfather that just dropped on there, bro. I can't do this. <laughs> That's Godfather doing? 1. Is that the Yeah, movie? dude, Godfather, such a good movie. Have you, like, watched him like that? Mm, I don't know. Oh my gosh, dude. Fucking See, that's the Godfather movies. trilogy. If I'm not mistaken, that's the games. It's all the games right there. Oh, uh, okay. That's tight. Oh, uh, no. That might be the movie, huh? Oh, no. That might be. I think they're the movies. Oh, that's the movies for sure. Anyway. Anyway, I'm trying to show you the game, other game, baby. Yeah, I know. You get distracted easily. Easily distracted. I was trying to see because I know that they, I'm pretty sure. It was, no, you know what it wasn't even Godfather. It's called. It's Mafia. Mafia, yeah. Don't fucking pretend like you I know. I knew what it was. I knew what it was. Don't okay. pretend like you know what's on my mind. Baby. Oh, he almost fell. Oh, my goodness. He almost fell. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. The monster. Are you checking it out, babe? This doesn't show anything before that. You could have just left it like it was. Shh, 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 shh
I know, dude. I pulled out my. So I think they just came out with some new cyberpunk gameplay as well. I don't know. I don't want to watch too much gameplay because I've already seen enough of that. I want to be surprised. I don't want to like. Don't tell me what's going on. I want to be surprised on my own. Definitely. And like even with the like the last one that I saw with Keanu, it's like oh when you would go well, go down this path and then this happened and all this shit, I'm like no nah, dude, why did you just tell me all that? I don't want that to happen. Hey hey hey, no no. <laughs> Look right there, Cyberpunk 2077 new gameplay, 20 minutes 4K. Yeah, I'm not watching that. Ah, uh, the car! They got the <laughs> I car know, on there! I know, I just saw that! The car is so dope, dude! Everything about that game is so dope! It's fire, dude. Baby! Baby boo! Baby boo 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 boo! <laughs> FF, what the fuck is FF? I don't know. FFS. Right? That's a little boy. Death Loop is basically Edge of Dishonored. You wish, Beetle Bra. <laughs> maybe next time, just go ahead and sub. Maybe you'll go ahead and get a, a, a slight view of it. <laughs> Not. Come on, bro. Hey, don't show. Hey, don't make me show you the, the finger through the thing through the through the through the, through Dude, the dick don't hole. Don't do that. Don't do that again. That was like. What just happened right now? I can't believe you did that, dude. Look at this, come here. Daddy, baby, butt. <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> Lucas, you're so sweet. <laughs> Big Cody, what's up, bruh? <laughs> I think because the light's on, like, maybe he's just not tired. I don't know what's going on with this dude. Oh, he's going to pass out uh, at some point. Just let him kind of wander around and, and tire himself out. Oh, hell yeah, bro. Coaster, my dog, bro. What's up, <laughs> pimp? I see you've been on and shit. I seen you was on like like not too long ago recently and shit. Beetlejuice, you're funny, my boy. I know you don't want to get that boot, do you? <laughs> it looks pretty good, bro. How will it, how will it fill up your ass? <laughs> 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 you can't say that fool's name three times, so. <laughs> Yeah, no, I got. I think I've only said it once. I think, so I'm good. I'm you can good. Say right it now. all the way through. So I think that you're good. Oh, okay, okay, I you can say. I can say still say. Beetle. You can't say beetle with the second part. I got you. It. You know what I'm saying? Cause you don't want that motherfucker running. Around. I want to say it so badly right now. You don't want him running around in here, dude. <laughs> we don't need that motherfucker running around. <laughs> don't say. His, don't say his name, man. We don't need that son of a bitch running around. <laughs> Fucking love that movie. Side. 
Dude, I played Madden 20, bro. It's been cool and shit. I got a, I got a literally a 99 defense. I got a 98-0. But, uh, I don't know, man. That's a life grind, bro. That's a fucking life grind, bro. It's a life grind, bro. When you play Madden, that's a life grind. <laughs> I already got two players and, and, and you know ready to go. Yeah. If I was to get Madden Madden 21, then I'd have I'd have players on there already. Yeah, man. I don't know, bro. I'm like, I'm just tired of, man. When I get it, I just have, like, committed myself, dude. Yeah. Firefox, what's up, bro? You know, he's, he's getting tired. He's trying to get fussy. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't have a bedtime yet. Whenever it's bedtime, yeah. Whenever he gets tired. See, the secret is if you keep him up, then you get to sleep in. See? <laughs> exactly, huh? <laughs> a lot of people don't daughter, know. That. Daughter sleep. Well, they just put him to bed. And then they have to get up early because they're awake, and then you gotta get up early no matter how late you stayed up. So just let him run him up. <laughs> let him run him up. Out. And then he'll pass out and sleep in. <laughs> dude, take time out of your day. That game like takes time out of your year, dude. <laughs> that game is a constant. Bro, that game takes time out of your fucking life, bro. Frustration. And yeah, that's the thing. It's not even that. It's not even just the time consumption, bro. They literally, they literally like make you crazy, like spend crazy cash. And if you're not spending cash, bro, you're not getting like, love. You're not getting no love. But not yeah. even just that, dude. You're dealing with kids that literally live on YouTube. That's like giving out game plans, so everybody uses the same ass game plan. Nobody even thinks for themselves. I feel like I'm one of the only people that literally strategizes a game plan that I put together on my own. This isn't like I don't go on YouTube and find these fools' channels and start picking apart their game plan. And let me, oh, what what uh, playbook you got, bro? Like all this, like man, that shit is just. Well, and then they like tell each other all the little secrets. <laughs> like they yeah, that shit's all bad, bro. Own. Exactly. Oh, the, all like the the fucking uh, what you call it, bro? The unstoppable routes and shit, dude. And then like the defense that that just literally covers everything up. All they gotta do is change a couple of like blues or, or like yellows and shit. I mean, not <laughs> yellows. I'm sorry, uh, purples and shit. But you gotta get the new uniforms. <laughs> shit, I got all the uniforms. <laughs> But they won't be in Vegas anymore. Like, they won't be in Vegas. You gotta get the new one so they'll be in Vegas. That's why I wanna get the 21, because <laughs> I wanna see the Vegas stadium. I know, dude. Hey, if there was a fucking opportunity for me to, like, shine, like, pick Madden, uh, pick Madden up and just shine, you know what I should have done, bro? I should have literally stayed on Madden 20 and just been filming. If I had been streaming all of Madden 20, bro, I could have showed fools how to put together like a 98 squad. And I literally stopped playing Madden 20 in like February. And I still had the fucking, the means and everything that was needed to buy shit 
to put together 99 squad when they drop the cards you know what I'm saying so I could literally show fools I got the knowledge how to how to show fools how to build a team without spending it really close to any cash I think I spent like 30 bucks or some shit oh wait did I spend that 20 recently did I spend that 20 uh, you know what I think I was thinking about spending the shit I don't know if I did or not but yeah, 30 to 50 bucks ain't shit. Yeah. Fools are spending like thousands, bro, Christmas, so. Christmas, I think, was the last one that you spent. Was it? No, maybe tax, but like when we got our, I think maybe you put like 20 bucks in for the draft. <coughs> was it the draft? Mm, I, I don't know. I don't remember what the packs were, but yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but we've been playing, well, he's been playing Hunts a lot lately. I've been playing uh, Predator. Yeah, Apex is good. Apex is a good game, for sure. Uh, I definitely like that, uh, what you call it, too. The uh, H1Z1, that's a good game as well, shit. I got the, what do you play though, Brody bro? West Coast, do you play that shit, uh, what you call it, my boy, the uh, Ultimate Team? That's where you fucked up though. It's the ultimate team like gets you like you get drugged into it. Motherfucker, you and that boy Hellfire is the one that got me on that shit. <laughs> I was literally good, bro. And I was the best motherfucking player I could be. Cause all I was playing was head to head online, head to head online, head to head online. So I literally had a game plan that could win with the fucking Raiders, bruh. The weak ass Raiders fucking roster. I'm winning with that. So what the fuck do you think is gonna happen when I go on Ultimate Team? Fucking dominate motherfuckers that are spending cash. Cause I can win with a team that has next to nothing. So what do you think I'm gonna do when I have everything? Fucking dominate. But I'm still, I'm not gonna act like I'm trash bro. I'm still good. I'm still hard to beat on Madden 20. But I'm nowhere near the where I was when I when I first started playing Ultimate Team. Like on Madden fucking 13, Madden 13, bro. Nobody can see me, bro. <laughs> yeah, but you can buy cards for like a thousand and resell them for. I'm not talking about that. I'm not talking about Ultimate Team. Uh, you're just talking about. I'm talking about in general, bro. Like play. Like nobody Dude, you're can, all you're good at Madden though. Nobody like, can fucking see me on Madden 13, bro. Madden 13, bro. I literally feel like I was I was one of the best motherfuckers in the world at at, at Madden 13, bro. Yeah, bro, <laughs> head to head. Head to head, bro, makes you kill, bro. <laughs> if you play, because you got to think, on Ultimate Team, you got to grind the auction block. You got to do these solos and shit that are on an easier mode. If you're literally on head to head 24-7, all you're doing is playing games, playing games, playing games. Can you imagine how much experience you're fucking gaining just playing games 24-7? You're in a game. You're not grinding this fucking so low out, you're not on the auction block buying shit, you're not filling like sets and shit, you're not, do you're not upgrading cards, you're just playing head to head bro, that's all you're doing. I feel you dubs, I feel you bro. Hey, you know, I try to be off top. <laughs> The problem with the Ultimate Team is because they have you doing so much shit, I think it kind of throws your game off. Because then you get used to like playing all that in against the computer and all this shit. You That's what they like, did on Madden 13 that was so fire though. You could be on Ultimate Team and you don't feel like you're diluting your skills at all because you could literally play on the hardest difficulty possible. You put it on the hardest difficulty. 
they have it now where like you can choose harder difficulties on every single solo battle. That's what they did on Madden 20. They changed a lot of shit for the better on Madden 20. Like from 19, from 18, all that shit. They changed a lot of shit for the better and fixed the game. Excuse me, for Madden 20. That's the reason why I jumped on board and I, and I bought it again. Because I literally, after Madden 18, dude, I was like, bro, I'm never buying a fucking Madden again, bro. They literally just are a terrible company. They don't care about their fans. Not even a little bit, bro. I'm not buying that shit no more. Then I seen all the stuff that they fixed. They literally took the whole year. They didn't add really any features, none of that shit. All they did was fix gameplay. All right, my man. You already know, my man. Hit us up, Brody, bro. Have a good night. You already know. But, uh... So, I'm just looking for variety, man, as a, as a whole in the gaming community. We all need to be stepping up and holding these, these people that make games to a higher standard. Third party, third party games should never be exclusive in my personal opinion. Well, third party games shouldn't be like the leading fucking games out there either, dude. Nah, but I mean it's hard for them not to be. They're selling on multiple platforms. So. I don't mean, as, <laughs> I don't mean sales wise. I mean quality wise. Like why would a, why would a third party be better than the exclusives? Like come on dude. I mean, I don't see I don't see where a third party game. You know, I take that fucking back. This generation, third party, everything's been better than first party. <laughs> exactly. Now nah, I don't like, know. Like first party's been all single player though. Be like, well, there you go. You hit the nail on the head. Me, I'm a multiplayer guy, so that's the reason why I'm taking that that perspective. If we're talking about game quality, we already know Sony's fucking dominating, and even Xbox has some fire ass exclusives that are you know, on another graphical level than you're gonna get from third party shit. But when third party developers are the only ones coming out with multiplayer experiences, that, there lies the problem. We're not getting any Sony first party quality, MS first party quality multiplayer experiences that are worth really like, devoting hella time on and dominating. But yeah, man. You know, it's ready to play some games? Like, I'm ready to play something. Yeah, shit, we can stream. <laughs> shit, we're gonna play a game. I think, yeah, I think we're gonna play some Predator. We might play some Predator or some shit. I would play some Hunt, homie, out there, but. Oh, oh appreciate you. you, Huskies. I made that. Yeah, that was my idea, and she put it together like a champion. I thought of that shit like, bro, the world in space, bro. Boom. Dude, she's a freaking artist, though, bro. She could really do some crazy shit. Oh, check it out, bro. She's doing this one for our kid right here, bro. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it, but it's going to be... Uh, Jason and shit with the um, alien killing the alien and then it's gonna have like predator in the back and shit posted up watching the scene so yeah bro she's a she's a beast so yeah bro what games, man? What games, bro? What games are you looking forward to bringing over from PS4 to the next generation? Yeah. Good shit, Husky. Mag from Mag from P3. There you go. Yeah, bro. I think we're getting ready to do the, uh, I think we're going to do some gaming here. Oh, yeah. I got Destiny 2. I just haven't played it in a little minute because I haven't bought the latest the DLC or whatever it was. Uh, 
Oh, that's lit, Husky. You already know. Oh, you couldn't see it that good? I know, that's what, that's the... It's this tough so to try to, because it's white right now. She's gonna add some more color to it. She's barely starting it off, you know what I'm saying? It's just right now, it's just Jason with the uh, with the alien right there. Yeah, I don't know. Fire though. And then it's gonna have Predator in the back and shit, posting up, watching the scene. But yeah, man. Random lady, random lady, she's dominating that chat. I think I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna play some Predator or if I'm gonna play some damn Friday right now. What do you think, babe? Uh, whatever you want until he's asleep and then. Yeah, I think I might play some Friday right now, bro. Anybody want to watch? I'm going to start the stream back up right now, but I'm going to go ahead and play some games because just sitting right here, I don't want to keep you guys bored just sitting here not talking about much. I feel like I kind of uh, discussed the, the shit that I wanted to talk about for now. Um, I definitely want to put some more shit together because we want to start streaming more often on a more frequent uh, more frequent, frequent basis. <laughs> if I could speak. Um... But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and play some games and I'll start the stream back up right now. See you guys in a sec.